your name and position and the name of your company. Okay. Uh, my name is Ruby Liu. Uh, my position is the president of Guild Gem Laboratories. We are from Thai, mainland China. We have an uh, office in Los Angeles, Hong Kong, and Shenzhen. And uh, we are opening in Bangkok very soon. How many times have you been to Brazil? Uh, this is my third trip. How has this trip been so far? Okay. Every time I come to Brazil, I love this country even more. So tell me, what stones have you seen so far on your trip? Okay, uh, so far I've seen emerald, tourmaline, aquamarine, morganite, quinsite, and of course, paraiba tourmaline. Have you been impressed so far with the mines that you've seen in Brazil and the ability and expertise of Brazilian miners? Yes, I'm very impressed. I will be into uh, dozens of mines to a lot of countries, but uh, Brazil is the most impressive country to me. Do you feel that Brazil has one of the strongest environmental protection and attitudes to protect the environments and to protect workers? Uh, yes, I have to say, um, in Brazil, I see the most neat, uh, clean, organized mine uh, from a lot of countries I've been to. Tell me, did your visit to the mine here, the Paraiba mine, meet your expectations? Okay, uh, it's not only meet my expectation, it's beyond my expectation. It's so, so much fun. A lot of people say that Brazilian Paraiba, there's no mining, there's no production, there's no stones on the market. What do you think after what you've seen today? Okay, honestly, uh, previously, even I thought there are not so much uh, par uh, Pariba tourmaline in Brazil. But today what I see is very active mining going on. What do you think? The color of the Brazilian Pariba, the fine color stones, is it the most impressive that you've ever seen for tourmaline? Yes, yes. Even from the rough, you can see it's neon blue. It's so intense and beautiful. How did you feel when you're inside the mine, Ruby, and you see, you see the workers going through the gravel and sending it to the processing plant? Is there a sense of excitement? It's such an exciting and unique experience. And um, I feel honored today. I, I had the honor to press the button to start the blast. And what is your goal? Okay, you have a gemological laboratory, you have an educational institute of gemology. What is your goal regarding China and knowledge and sources? Okay, uh, actually uh, my gem lab is working very hard on educating the market. So our goal is to bring China to the source, to bring source to China, to educate the market. And we want to promote all kinds of high quality color stone to make the uh, bis uh, color business, color stone business, scalable and sustainable. And like you said, you've been all over the world. How do you find the Brazilian people and the people in the industry we've dealt with, like today with Clement and Sebastian? Uh, okay. I found the most friendly, warm hearted, generous people, really. That's in, from the bottom of my heart. Thank you very much.